what is going on everybody jay here from maji and jay today i'm coming back after exactly five days and i want to thank everybody that watched a little video that i completed about being at puerto rico i was there for about five days or so and i was completing some business and no i'm not opening a store in puerto rico i'm not doing any gambling or anything like that it was just some personal matter that i needed to resolve luckily everything is resolved everything is okay and on that video i saw that you guys commented for me to bring some souvenirs from puerto rico and here I have them on the background this is just some of it if you guys want me to complete a video showing you everything that i brought from there just let me know on the comment section below and i will complete it for you yes we had tons of funds it just reminded me of my entire childhood in puerto rico as i was born and raised there so yes guys i had tons of funds and here i'm coming back with tons of product as a matter of fact i have about seven products sitting on my table and a lot of it was on my porch so i was very afraid that they were going to get stolen and luckily none of them are stolen even though they were on a little bunch on the porch so they were clearly visible to the public but again everything is here and everything is okay and i do have a lot of clones i have a lot of chinese phones like the one you see right here in the background the yumi max and the video is coming very shortly so this is a Bluetooth speaker that I purchased from Amazon. It's called the Blitzwolf BWF4. It does have tremendous build quality. It's uh, made of aluminum, plastic, and also metal. So yes, the build quality is absolutely phenomenal. The sound quality is great as it is a 20 watt speaker and it does have radiators and such. So getting a look here around the box, we can see that we don't have anything exciting. As a matter of fact, the box is just a rebrand. It's very cheap, but getting a look inside of the box is where we're going to find the main attraction here. And let me tell you guys, at first I was a little bit skeptical about this product, but again, after testing it for about a day or so, I was truly amazed on the quality that it has. So this is the Bluetooth speaker itself. We can see on the top here, we got all the buttons. On the side is pretty much plain. On the front here we have the two speakers together with the radiator. And on the side here is plain. On the back side we just got the charging port together with the 3.5mm headphone jack, the power key. And that's all we got here. On the bottom side is just going to be the rubberized shoes and some information here about the speaker itself. And that's all we got around here. So let me go ahead and set it aside. We also find a divider inside of this box. And this is where we're going to find the auxiliary cable in case you want to connect something directly from it. And this is going to save you a lot of battery as well. And the sound quality is usually better. We also got here the USB cable. Let's use a micro USB. And finally, we have here some booklets. Some of it is for the warranty. And the other one is for the manuals. And it does have a QR code in case you want to learn more about this company or download the manuals directly on your smartphone. So that's all we have inside of the box. So now let's talk more about the Bluetooth speaker. Getting a better look on the upper side of the Bluetooth speaker, we're going to find a proprietary call key. Now this is only intended for that purpose. You cannot use it for anything else. We also have a volume rocker up and down. We have a forward and back key or forward and back key. We have a play and pause and on the upper left hand side corner we had the Blitz logo and on the lower right hand side corner here we're going to find the LED light. When it's charging it's going to turn red, when it's fully charged it's going to turn green and also when you power it on without charging and when it's paired to the Bluetooth it'll be blue. So yes everything is very self explanatory and on the back side here we're going to have the microphone. I forgot to mention that. So yes guys it's a very easy to use Bluetooth speaker and let me tell you the build quality on it is super super nice. I believe that this one one is about 696 grams so that makes it very very heavy it's almost a pound and considering how small this thing is it's very well built it's almost as heavy as the Bose Soundlink Mini that I own about almost a month ago and that's because I gave it away to my brother but when I went to Kissimmee to pick up my daughters I went ahead and tested it with him and the quality was almost identical but of course the Bose was always a little bit better keep in mind that this one has a price point of only 60 US dollars so with this being said, I'm not going to bore you guys with all the details about the Bluetooth speaker. What I'm going to do next is go ahead and pair it on and show you guys how to pair with it, which is really, really simple. Now, something that I did notice is that the power key must be held for about five seconds before you can see this thing coming on. Now, when it's charging, it does it a little bit faster. I'm not sure if that's maybe a factory flaw of some kind. But yes, I did notice that and I wanted to make you guys aware so that way you don't think that your Bluetooth speaker is broken. So the first thing you must do is go to your smartphone and turn on your Bluetooth just so that you can pair with it. And here I'm going to show you guys the website where I got it from. Once again is uh, Amazon. So I just stopped here the Bluetooth for a second. Let's go here into the application and I believe I have it open already. And here is the 
uh, product itself you can see that it is about 60 US dollars and since it's prime you can do get it in about two days for free which is really really nice and this cell in particular does have a lot of uh, feedback on this particular model and there we can see the specifications of the speaker and such this is in case you guys are lazy and don't want to open the link you can go ahead and read it here directly from my smartphone so now with this being said let's go ahead and power this thing on like I said before it takes about five seconds or so until you see the LED light coming on there we go now you let it go and now that's the blue light meaning that it is connected to the Bluetooth or connecting to the Bluetooth and I believe it has completed already and then it will remain solid blue so if you look here onto or on the smartphone we can see that yes it is currently connected so our next test here will be to test the sound unfortunately I have to use non copyrighted songs so I do apologize if you guys don't like them and hopefully you guys agree that this thing does have tremendous quality I mean the clarity of the voices uh, the bass is a little bit better I would say that on the Bose but now when it comes to the voices the Bose uh, selling mini is a little bit better and I would say uh, it does have much more clarity but it's still guys for the price you really can't beat it so let's go ahead and test it out and hopefully you guys tell me if it's worth it or not Well guys, there we witness a little bit of the sound quality on this little Bluetooth speaker and as you guys heard, it's actually quite impressive considering that this is only $60 but yes, it doesn't compare completely to the Bose SoundLink Mini unfortunately but the build quality and the material that they use makes it feel very nice and also firm on the hand and if this is something that you guys are looking forward to then this is a Bluetooth speaker that you must definitely get. Um, I think I forgot to mention that the battery inside which is one of the most important features, I don't know how this slipped through my mind but it's it's a 4,000 million battery. I think I have written it on the description below, so you guys have probably checked it by now. It's going to give you a usage of about seven hours if you're using Bluetooth only, and if you're using the auxiliary cable, which is this one right here, it's going to give you almost 10 hours of usage. So I would say it's quite decent, uh, considering that it is only a 4,000 million battery. Now something that we're not going to get with this Bluetooth speaker um, that we get from other competitors is the rugorized material that makes it very durable. Also, we're not going to get the waterproof capabilities and we're not going to get the uh, power bank. So we have seen that on many speakers before, something that I found to be very, very convenient. But, but this particular model is not going to be available. But this being said, if you guys think that this thing is worth it, make sure that you let me know in the comment section below. Also, don't forget to like this video if you find it helpful. Don't worry guys, the giveaway video is coming right after this one. And now, if I don't complete the giveaway video tomorrow, it'll be completed in the next two days. That's because I'm packed with tons of product and a lot of it are very important. You guys must see them before you go out there purchasing phones and stuff. So just stay tuned to the channel. And if you guys again like the video, don't forget to hit the like button. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys on my next one.